Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's me. The end of Jesus, the end of Pi, the end of that price. You know me. My debauchery on TikTok. All my own debaucheries. Now, since so today is going to be a different day, um, I am doing a unique fashion. I have multiple outfits I'm going to try on because guess what? Victoria Beckham. Victoria Beckham invited me to a, a damn a online fashion show. So I'm already excited. So, in, in all to all to Miss Victoria Beckham. I wouldn't do a fashion design for her to see if she likes it or not. Who knows if she'll comment. If she does, oh my god, that'll be the greatest place whatever. So, it's a lot of pieces. Um, the, uh, the cops gave it to me last night on my way home. They had to do to me and they were like, here, try that. Oh, I don't know if they caught it on camera, but whatever. No matter. So, I have their support. So, I'm really excited about that. Um, I really have And then the FBI that I met, um, they gave me. Here, yeah, this is what the FBI gave me. It's a, it's a Muslim guy. He's upset that my, my piece got taken. So, as you see, he gave me this. This one here. It's coming for me, sir. I haven't decided how I'm going to wear it just yet. But. I got to the Muslim. Um. And so they also, um, Derek Yeager, last night, um, gave me. Remember, got stolen. Remember when someone tried to kill me, and they cut my hand open. I should have went to the doctor, and had them look at my hand, but whatever. He gave me this, which is really cool. It's um, it's made by. Um, um oh, never mind. But it's a battery charger and a hand warmer. Isn't that interesting? It's really going cool, it? Um and then of course the other smuggles. And you already know I'm working on this here. And then to show you how sneaky the US government is, they told me I have to go apply for my passport. So I have to go to the library and apply for a passport. But my birth certificate is in my dad's house. Remember, my dad's dead. My dad's girlfriend killed him. Remember, I went to T-Mobile and there's certain things that they said the T-Mobile bill was cut off without a death certificate. And what? The only account holders is me and Tracy Brown. I'm Tremont Brown. I have my ID. Tracy's deceased. He does not have his ID. And Pika, you're from Thailand. You are a visitor in our country. You killed a military serviceman and didn't think that through. When I say I'm a Coast Guard baby, my dad was a Coast Guard. I'm his child. Get it, Coast Guard baby. I was born in the military. My brother was born out of the military, so he gets no protection. He was born overseas. He gets no protection. So, I don't care, Lorraine Brown. You made it clear. And when I saw you, I asked you one question. Why does dad look that way and why haven't you got to get him to the hospital? Why did you text me to let me know how bad he was? He looked at me and said, I don't know. Then there, there's your answer. That means you have a problem with dad. Get it? And when you commit murder in my family, I will hunt you down. My auntie Viola was murdered, and I believe that strong heart. And what? I know I hear it. The, the, the string rings, that's 18. That was me hitting that buzzer. Auntie, auntie, auntie. That was me. So, like I said, as I create my fashion show, Zachary, I'm going to dress a nice woman for you. I took your picture, see how you do. Because I went to CVS, this niggas behind me, that niggas I haven't done my damn life behind me, standing there swooping on an electric bike like he didn't see me. And Mr. Ballin, Mr. Ballin. That's the job I was applying for, you juice. To do this. That. You guys sent me the UPA report, I started looking at it. I know there's a lot of information that's taken from there, so you guys are not giving them full information, full disclosure. So, welcome to my morning.